And we saw this diverse group of people, just like I see here today. And we worshiped with them, we ate lunch with them, and as we got in the car, I said to Susan and Kurt, that may be as close to what heaven is going to be like as we can experience here on earth. But as we began to talk, and Kurt and I took what we found there to our United Way board, they supported the idea of us helping to birth this congregation along with the United Methodist Conference. And I don't think there are many United Ways in our country that can say we help birth a church. <laughs> but we are definitely one. We, we worked together. We supported Kurt as he went over for his uh, few weeks of, of looking at what was going on at Triune. And I can hardly come here on a Sunday morning with worship without becoming very emotional about what I've seen happen over the past five years. And I am thankful for Susan's support. I am thankful for the United Way support and our board and how they took that to heart, that we could do something special and be part of something that was going to touch so many lives. And it's done just that. And as I think of every time that I've been here at the close of the service, the song that says loving God and loving each other says exactly what this is about. Later, as we were working on this, I found out that long before I was ever born, my grandmother lived on the mill here, Mill Hill here, and worked at Orr Mill and attended this church. It has a very special place in my heart. So, Kurt, thank you for the continuing ministry. I look back, I've met so many people, and I'm looking directly at Caroline Talbert. The ministry that her life has been to me and it was all because of meeting her here. Thank you. And uh, DS, thank you for your continued support. This is a wonderful place, touching so many lives. Thank you. Thank you.